The faces of the Denver Broncos are very young. They are intense faces, reflecting the pressure of playing clubs invariably older and usually wiser. But they are also confident faces that love to play. And the Broncos, barely averaging 23 years of age, have now won four out of five. Floyd Little, number 44, recovered from injuries, capitalized on the best Denver line play of the year by setting a Bronco rushing record of 146 yards. His total for the past two games, 275 yards, which in Denver used to be a good season. But with little running for 55-yard touchdowns like this, the Bronco running game seems healthy, if not potent. Quarterback Steve Tensey, number 13, has been hobbled by injuries too. And although Marlon Briscoe has substituted magnificently, Tensey is becoming the performer the Broncos need to become a title contender. Tensey threw for over 200 yards and two touchdowns. This 50-yarder to rookie Bill Van Heusen put the Broncos out of reach in the second quarter 21 nothing. Van Heusen isn't the only rookie surprise. Garrett Ford, number 32, sounds like a car, but hits like a truck. His 17-yard run in the fourth quarter carried him into an end zone apparently spread evenly with hot coals by the now desperate Patriots. As easily as the Broncos moved the ball in the right direction, the Patriots moved in the wrong one. Even the great Jim Nance could only average two yards per carry. Defensive ends Pete Duranko number 55 and Rich Jackson number 87 combined to dump Boston quarterback Tom Sherman on several occasions. And when they weren't on his back, the Broncos secondary was as they intercepted four of his passes. The Broncos got the breaks, but they worked for them as the days of the pushovers from Denver seem numbered indeed. Just ask those veteran faces what the score is. 